So I think I just need to cut plant a couple of the big spruce like sequoia taiga trees. That's what I'm looking for. Taiga? Um, oh my god, what is oh that's a squid. <laughs> so when you plant spruce saplings in a two by two, uh -huh. so that's four four of them, they grow into giant fucking Yes, trees. I've seen that. They're so fucking cool looking. But what the reason why I want to do it currently like I, I did it to harvest all the spruce for my house. Yeah. Um, but the reason I want to do it currently is because I'm going to do it out by my farm because when they grow, they spread podzol, which is a special kind of like the brown and green grass that they, they grow on naturally in their in their oh, biome. Oh, okay. And the reason I want to do that is then you can plant mushrooms on the on it and then the mushrooms will spread across it. Oh, <gasps> shut so up. I can, a, I can have a mushroom farm. Oh, lucky. That's gonna be fucking dope. You're gonna have to show me when you're done. Please. But then my farm will have everything. All of the things. Yep, that'll be the, that's the last thing that I have yet to actually farm out. So what are you gonna do the next then? Uh finish my house. Oh sick, alright, <laughs> yeah. Inside. Like the whole one side of the house I'm going to convert into like an actual inn style thing. Ooh so that, yes. Because then, then it can all walk out onto the onto the hot springs. Yes. I wish the turtles would come fuck over here and not over there. But I'm gonna need wool for that, which means I'm going to need to set up a nightmare machine. Oh no. That's easy to make, but it's a nightmare to watch. Because it literally <laughs> just cycles sheep in a circle and automatically shears them. Oh my oh. god, that is kind of horrifying. <laughs> yeah, that's about the only thing I need to do manually on my uh, sheep farm. Is shear them? Con constantly, yeah. constantly shear them. Yeah, see, that's why I'm going to put it like out back behind my... Um, behind my my bath area yeah. so that it's close enough to my house that it stays loaded oh yeah that'll be smart and then well while i'm online or while anybody's like hanging out here and then that way it'll just like i get like at least one sheep of every color and then i'll just have wool of every color forever. i love breeding the sheep that used to be one of my favorite things to do because it was just hilarious my uh, my sheep just... barn has uh, six sheep of every color in it Ooh. right now. <laughs> ask ask Sajin. It is maybe a little bit big. <laughs> yeah, no, it, it it works. But that's why I want to make an automat because then I don't have to worry about shearing them and the, the wool just collects. Yeah, I know that makes sense. I don't know why I thought it would only be a a, a moderately big building <laughs> and then i started leveling off the area and yeah 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 I like, like i, I really goes. like this doing this one because it's this is the first time i've done like a decently sized building without having to really spend a full day landscaping the area it was just yeah. a nice flat area on its own yeah that's yeah dope. I had to, I had to landscape an area of 87 blocks long for Holy this barn shit. so yeah um yes <laughs> no, yes. I uh, on one of them, at least one of my other builds. I have I have straight up leveled full mountains. That's to dope. Make room for builds in the past, like I did. I think the last one I did was a I did like a, a Japanese style like castle in the mountains. Ooh. And like, cause I found like there were these mountain. It was a mountain biome, but then there was like a low kind of flat spot with a lava pool. Yeah. There, and that was the, so that was the first time I was like, I saw the lava pool, and I was like, oh, I could make like a demonic Tory gate thing, yeah. and then do like a, a, a demon king's castle type thing. Oh yes, that's gonna be and, dope. Like and I had and to shit. like level parts of the mountain <laughs> to oh like down to the building area because it was. Like the the main section of the castle was, uh, I think I did a full sixty four by sixty four for that one. It was four Ouch. chunks for like wow, yeah. and that was the in the inside was sixty. So it was really sixty six by sixty six for the foundation. Insane, dude. That's so cool. That one I think I spent like three days landscaping for. Did you have fun? 
Yeah. I mean, that's good. I like, I kind of like landscaping to a certain extent. There I'm, comes a time I'm, when it's too much. I'm yeah, really I'm good at just flipping on some music and just like grinding it out. Bra like just brain dead. Yeah. Holding down my left click. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I do that too. That's exactly what I do at my parents' house. You just Oops. go brain dead every time you visit your parents? Yeah, I play Minecraft and go brain dead. Okay. <laughs> yeah. That's how I like survival get out of conversation. Technique. It is. It's a survival technique. Get high and put on Minecraft and they think I'm like checking emails. It's excellent. I'm running out of dirt! I will have a tree farm. That is one of the, like, but big landscaping projects like that is also one of the reasons that I love, like, mod packs for mine. What kind of mod packs do you use? All kinds. Um, I tend to shy away from the technology ones because mm. there's too much. Like, some people, and it's fine for some people, but, um, like, some people really just go hard on, like, automating everything. So you yeah. Build these big, complicated machineries, and then they're just like, this is a laser drill. It just pulls up ores out of the earth and generates them and puts them into this chest and then this will take them out of that chest and like smelt them or break them down or whatever yeah and then like this will just build things for me and then after a week they're like everything's automated i just stand here and everything that i want is made for me that doesn't just, sound fun fun. to me yeah like so I, I i tend i tend to go more towards like magical and adventuring packs like yeah. things add extra dimensions Ooh, i didn't um, even know you could do that like there's one mod that I really there's a couple mods that I really look for in a mod pack. One is Tinker's Construct, which basically get, makes it so that tool crafting is a little more immersive. Like you make the shaft, you make the head, you make the connector out of whatever oh, part. Oh like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Want, and then you put them together, and so then you can have like. And so what that does is it makes it so that you can have like instead of having like a stick for a handle, you could have like a steel like a, a an iron rod for your handle and give like the pickaxe oh, more durability that's so and, nice like, stuff like that and it's 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 pretty in depth like it's easy to learn the basics of but yeah. then it gets like it gets pretty good and then and then it, it's also easier like because you don't really enchant those you modify them yeah so then you can like throw a, a single diamond onto your like pickaxe and give it like diamond tipping so then you can break obsidian Ooh. and then yeah like, it's dope as fuck that is yeah. super dope i like that and then um there's exp like then they have it it works on weapons too it also adds weapons um like you can get like shuriken and like a bunch of different kinds of swords that like, have slightly different stats like if you want one that attacks faster versus yeah. hitting harder versus... that's kind of so cool though it so it's not like that. cheating it's just basically like adding content yeah yeah, and then there's like there's one um, dimensional one called the Twilight Forest, and that one's I think just the bread and butter adventure pack. Yeah, like there are uh, mod not pack, um, but what it does is basically if you have you take like your little two by two infinite water source, you put flowers on each of the sides. Okay. Or just completely surround it with flowers or whatever. So it's got 12 flowers around it. Then you stand above it or like right next to it or whatever so that you're at least partially over the water and then drop a diamond into it. It hits you with lightning and makes a portal to the Twilight Forest, which is a whole adventuring and mining like world. That's like dope. it's got like a bunch of different like bosses that you can go and hunt down in order and hell stuff like yeah. That. That's dope. We might have to do that eventually. I don't know. We'd have to get everybody to get them, though, I think. It's memory yeah, intensive, um, so, though. Is it really? really? The, with the, the, Twitch, the Twitch desktop launcher makes it a lot easier for, like, once you have what you want. Yeah. So you can go on there. You can do, like, a forge, like, create your own. You could create your own mod pack. Um, some of the mods will want you to, like, ask their mod creator for permission, but really most of them are just, like, so long as you credit the mod creator, yeah, like, you don't absolutely. say you made the mods yourselves or whatever. Oh my god, I'm sure some um, douchebags go out there and yeah. try to take credit and shit. Oh yeah, they do. Um, but both basically, so what it is, is then you'd, like, open up your Twitch launcher, you'd go to the mods tab, you'd select Minecraft, mm -hmm. you'd say, like, create your own, like, create a custom mod pack or whatever. 
and then you could build like take the mods that you specifically want put them into it onto whatever like the version of minecraft that they're com most, like compatible with or whatever yeah. and then um then you could publish that mod pack and so then people from the community you could be like classy katie's like uh... server mod pack or whatever and then and then you could publish it and then people from the community would be able to go into their twitch desktop, twitch desktop app look it up and then download it and then it's a lot easier it's That's just the, the more painful part is just getting it set up yeah i mean that's with anything yeah but then once once you have like the pack itself created and it work and it's working as a sir like with server files then you can just have people download it and then they can they can just use it. With it yeah that's dope what up, Bendy? How you doing, Honey Bean? I'm doing pretty good. How's life for you? I'm just hacking stuff, hacking and slashing, hacking and whacking, hacking and whacking and slashing. <laughs> yes. Hacking and whacking and all that song is burned into me for the rest of my existence, mm -hmm. forever. That was the best yep. part about Fallout was the soundtrack. It was a little repetitive though. I wish they would have got more songs. Yeah. My only so, I mean, that's with any anything that you yep. play long enough. I know. Yes, I know this song now. Yep, I know this like, song GTA, by heart. GTA yeah. 5 had a ton of music on it, but I mostly just listened to the nonstop pop, pop mm -hmm. channel. So now I have all of those songs ingrained into me. I think the new GTA, couldn't you put your own music in? I feel like I remember that. You could, but it was only as a private radio station, so oh, none of your friends oh, that's would bummer. be able to listen to it yet. Hopefully they fix that in GT6. Yeah. They just didn't know what they were working on. I want my friends to be able to listen to the fuck, especially in RP and stuff. Like if I roll up in my car, I want everyone to hear what the fuck I'm listening to. It's horrifying down here. Am I breathing forever? Minecraft Wait. is low key a horror no, game. Low key one, is a strong term. One of the mod packs I, packs I really like has a a drying rack in it, and Aww. that's with Tink yeah, that's put, with Tinker's construct. Yeah, you, you can put beef, you can put um, like the rotten meat and the and, and regular meat on it, and make beef jerky and um, leather and things like that. It's really dude, yeah. that's awesome. Mm, that? Zombie jerky. Mm, I mean, at least it gives a use to that I love shit. Jerky. I love jerky too. I feel like Katie would have fun with like some of the magic mods because there's like blood magic and witchery. And Ooh, I would definitely have fun with those. Shit. Like you could do blood. You could literally do blood sacrifices to gain magical power. What? <laughs> yeah, blood magic. Yeah, yeah that's like, totally you could true. Literally, just cut that's yourself amazing. to gather up a bunch of blood. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to look into those. That would be really fun. There's Thomas one called Thomcraft, which is really in depth. What um, is it called? Thomcraft. It's Thom? thaumaturgy craft, oh, basically. Oh yeah. And that one does. It involves a lot of like magical research, but then you get like wands and shit, so you can like start spitting out fireballs. And oh my god! And like the potato. It's, it's nuts. I love Thomcraft. Is by by far my favorite magical. Uh, mod pack. Ooh, Johnny Star and it's has making made the advancement. It's, it's making a comeback too because the they're the mod maker that was running it for what had to take a break for like a couple of years. Oh. Because of real life stuff like yeah. in school. And I think he got like sick for a while, like bad sick for a while. Oh, but then he bummer. um he he announced like a few months ago or whatever, or like six months ago at this point I think that he was giving control of his of the mod pack over to one of the guys that makes a lot of the oh like, hell the, the, yeah the the team like yeah. the forge Minecraft yeah, yeah, yeah. team so then they're working on it now and it's it's been updated I think to one fourteen maybe one fifteen I can't remember which one but it's nice that it's coming back hell yeah that's really nice. Um, Thongcraft. <laughs> thong yeah. I get into There's thong probably craft. one of those in there. That is for sure what I heard. Also, 
I was like, sure, why not? Thong crown, yeah, whatever. <laughs> to each I own. would custom make a thong, why not? Strider Eden, what up? How are you? Long time no see. Oh my god, look at my turtles. Look at all my eggs. I don't want to see your eggs, Kate. Oh. No. Everybody, it's look at Katie's eggs. Like, what, 3,000 peas? Yeah, you, you could make some money. Dude, because I have multiple degrees, I can actually sell my eggs. Well, I could. I'm 32 is the cutoff, but I could have sold them for 10,000 a piece. Wait, there's a cutoff for selling your eggs? Mm -hmm. It's like they're not as fresh anymore. Yeah, literally. Oh, yeah. They ain't as good anymore once you're 32. They don't want your eggs. That and also I think the older you are, the more likely you are to get cancers from the weird home hormone therapy they put you through for it. Yeah. And so I think that has to do with oh, a lot of it. <laughs> they don't care about the young ones. Huh? The, uh, the, I just got a letter from the VA the other day. Oh, God. Saying that the, uh, the FDA has ordered a halt to all production of ranitidine, which is the ulcer medication I've been on for years. Yeah. And because uh, it's been linked to an increased risk of cancer now. Oh, my God. So it's just like, well, that's oh. it's a good thing I'm bad at taking daily medication. Yeah, like, for fuck's sake, dude, that's wild. They're like, so they're like, well, if you like, you should dispose of what you know, like your current supply <laughs> and uh, we'll just figure something else out for a new medication for your ulcer. So I was like, oh, thanks, Veterans Affairs, you dicks. Wow. I mean, to be fair, that That's, happens in wow. all hospitals, not just veteran yeah. affairs, but Jesus Christ. I know, but it's still, yeah, it's still just like... Uh, yeah, that's pretty... Yay yeah, for pushing, look out for that pushing, class action. Yeah. yeah. Yay for pushing medi medication through before the fucking... Oh, God, it's such bullshit. That's what Trump tried to do with this fucking malaria stuff. Yeah, that got, like, immediately killed people. Yes! This is people because he owned it. I think that's yeah, what everybody uh, found he out. Owns, he had he owns, money like, in it. Yeah, no, he has like a, I think like a 3% or a 7% stake in the company that makes it or something like that. That's insane. And then he tried to, and then he tried to buy a bunch of it from uh, India. And then like an, in, one of the Indian like foreign affairs officials or whatever, like got on TV and was like, no, fuck you. He actually did? <laughs> yeah. Like he tried to like wow. pay like a billion dollars or something like that to like get a bunch of it from India. And India was like, no, no, no. we're keeping it. We actually need it for malaria yeah, and if it's like fucking actually malaria <laughs> yeah and if it's actually linked as like to help with like coronavirus then they're definitely like want to keep it too we need wow. the malaria cure for fucking malaria you ass <laughs> seriously yeah. though oh god god lord save us all who knows what we're in for oh i don't have food i need to i need to get a food source can i eat fish No oh, yeah, I need to cook my fish. Can you cook it in like a a um a furnace? Oh yeah, God, tropical food, tropical food. fish doesn't cook. Oh, just so you're aware. Oh, lift control. Tropi tropical, Thank you so much for that tropical tub. fish is just consume. Oh, you just eat it. Yeah. So if I catch one, I just fucking eat it. Yeah, if okay. it's tropical fish, like some some of them are. Yeah. I'm gonna try. I I'm up. I'm sorry, Jesus. Every time, every time I hear you say the word Jesus, like full on like that, it's just it <laughs> reminds me of do it in the ass for Jesus. Oh my, you, you you're sung welcome. that on the stream before. Yep. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty accurate to be honest. Fuck my dick. God damn it. How do I throw? There you go. <gasps> Thank you for the food, Jackie! Oh my god, I can eat again and I don't have to eat fish. Thank yeah, you. you can go eat. Do you like my sandbar? I do. I love your little sandcastle. Thank you. It's adorable. I'm getting there. Very cute. I'm trying to build out my island so these turtles will stop fucking over here. Look at all these eggs. They won't get away from this one spot. It's asinine. Well, it's... it's wow. They're... they're birthing Aww. spot basically their birthing Very spot upsets up. me okay let's see Back. is anybody near the that's house that's not what I wanted to do I mean the house is pretty like oh did you teleport out to her yeah uh... sweet just like real life 
<laughs> Just like her life, Jackie has no idea where she's going. I mean... Like, so... I wrote oh, down the coordinates to my house. These stupid animals. Stagen should know. I like that someone's got like out in the big old kind of river lake thing west of the community area. Someone's doing it, like clearing out the water and building a big old castle looking thing or something. That's I can't what? tell I what. Teleport home. I can't I'm tell so what it is yet, but I can see it. We don't know what it is, but we're open to it. One of my fish got out. What a little douche. I could probably just go take my swing my boat around over there and actually take a look at it. Not today, little fishes. It's good stage and I got it. Jackie figured out how to teleport herself to Katie, Yay! give her food, and get home without dying. Nice. Super proud. Good job, Jackie. We're proud of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I would say, yeah, you can, like, instead of a, uh, instead of another person's name, you can always enter the coordinates in the second spot. Yeah, but then you have to know them first. Yeah. I did. I noted my home coordinates because I oh. smart. All right, I'm fixing it for you stupid turtles. Thanks, Dejan. <sighs> Oh fuck. So stupid, quit looking at me like stupid turtles. Look! They're more so sand. cute! Oh, oh, pussy. They're just staring at you. They are, they're in love with me. I Mom. Think... Did Mom. I have a baby? You give, us, you give us the good grass and then our dicks feel good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's true, I make them all horned up You've on grass. you created a couple of addicts. That's what, that's what it is. It's My bad. Oh my god, they do keep turning and staring at you. Yeah, they love me. <laughs> In the most inappropriate love way. Love me, love me. Say that you love me. Fool me, fool me. Go on and fool me. I can't. Something. Turtle farming isn't as easy as I thought it was going to be. No, the eggs take a while to hatch. <laughs> well, that and like it hatched and now I don't have a turtle anywhere. I don't know what, did it die? Why the fuck am I doing this, Captain? Oh, I thought you were going to fill it in like- I am filling it in, but I was trying to fill it in with like not the sand because the sand just falls, oh. you know? Well, yeah, I was, that's what I was thinking. I thought, I thought you were doing like, yeah, one layer down and then- Yeah, that's what I'm trying. Up. Do the sand on top. That's what I'm trying to do, so they have places to lay their children. Why do I hear a to giant scary noise? Complex. There's probably a scary thing trying to kill you nearby. I hate it. I mean, it's the ocean, and it's dark. And full of terrors. Yeah. Look, now you have plenty of birthing areas, you stupid turtles. I don't have any They're grass to feed you. These ones are gonna crack, but like, where does the baby turtle go? They probably make for the water. You think so? I mean, you think there's some baby yeah, turtles like out here, like chilling? Turtles. Yeah, like they go, they go out into the ocean and then fuck around for a bit, and then they come back eventually. Okay. And then you get the shell. Yay. But it's Trash. like, it's definitely one of the, like, you gotta, like, it's definitely one of the th th things in Minecraft that you gotta, like, be very patient about. It's it's very different from the rest of Minecraft. Uh, why did I pick the weird thing, Katie? Why do you do this to yourself? Because turtles are cute. Turtles are like cute. Fuck. I do. And it, also, you want an underwater breathing helmet. Yes, I do. I want us all to have them so we can all go exploring. <laughs> Give me your bones, give me your bones, give me your bones. Is my inventory full? Probably. Weird, don't want that. Give me your bones. I want the bones. 
Rattle me bones. All I want is the bones. I need the fertilizer. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Thank you. I've found the OCD sheep barn. Trash hunter, <laughs> have a beautiful night, honeybean. Thank you for hanging out with us. I hope you sleep well. Bye. Bye, trash hunter. Sleep so well, honeybean. I'm just glad you're not, like, doing cruel, like, cow farming. <laughs> me? I don't know how. Don't teach me no, how to do cruel uh, things. No, level zero. Oh. <laughs> there's, there's an entity limit per block, so what people will do is they will, um, like, trap, like, however many cows they can into a single space, like, with glass or whatever, and then put a dispenser underneath it. Or not a Seems dispenser. Seems a little fucked up. The other thing. A hopper underneath it. And then what they do is, um, they just breed them all together in that one square then you get a bunch of babies and it used to be like an entity limit of 24 so any once there were babies beyond the number limit of 24 then any of the adults it would like crush to death and then it would drop their meat and leather into the hopper into whatever inventory you had it connected to that is so fucked up yeah i i People might have <gasps> I might no, have didn't. built a. No, you didn't. I didn't need to confirm, nor did not. Automatic, no, an automatic chicken cooker. Yeah, I've, I've, I was planning on making one of those. <laughs> it basically you put You're the baby chickens dolphin. are yeah, underneath a block of lava, so when they grow up, they go up into the lava and burn to death and automatically cook. Get out of here, you stupid dolphin! Go, go away. <laughs> I just killed a dolphin somehow, or they're just dying. I don't know how this is happening. Why is this? I can cook dolphin now, so that's I'm a life skill I've bad. earned. Because I haven't slept in a few days, apparently. The dolphins? No, I'm I'm being attacked by phantoms. Oh yeah, I I haven't slept at all since we started this game. Phantoms are just a way of life for me at this point. I mean, I get the phantom membranes, which will be good when I get to the end. What are they for? Um, you use them to repair elytras. <gasps> There's a creeper oh, near my turtle Oh, you can also eggs. use them to make potions of slow falling. That's neat. There's a tur fucking creeper on my island right next to my turtle eggs, and I am so upset about this. I understand. Come here, you fuckhead. Get away from my turtle children. Get away from me. Yes, I killed him. Thank Jeebus. No explosions out here, motherfucker. Did you guys turn off creeper griefing? I don't know. It was turned back on. Oh, okay. I did not know that. Uh, that's because good. otherwise villagers can't breed. Oh. oh. That's interesting. And a little sad. Yeah, because apparently villagers like picking up items including food that other villagers give them is considered griefing oh and right. you have to f you have to throw food at the villagers and they have to pick it up and if griefing is off nobody can pick up no npcs can pick up stuff including the villagers oh it's a little heartbreaking womp womp yeah So it was t it was turned back on. So yeah, beware of creepers. Cool. They will I mean, I never stuff. let them live anyway, like long enough to explode anyway. But yeah, because I need gunpowder to make splash potions. What's a splash <laughs> potion? Oh, that was it's a maniacal a laughter. What's a splash potion? So you, any any kind of any potion that exists, you can add gunpowder to it and turn it into a splash potion, which basically just makes it a throwable version <laughs> of that potion. Ooh, that's exciting. So kind of like what the witches do. They throw potions at us. Yeah, but instead of like just doing potions of harming or potions of poison, you could do like a splash potion of fire resist. Then you and all of your friends hanging out together can all gather up in a tight little group and splash fire resist potion on yourself. And then you all get it from one potion. And then you can go swim in lava. Oh. For, Is there like, anything under minutes. the lava? 
more lava. Sometimes, ah, yeah. Okay. Wait, there really like, be like stuff under the lava, like stuff we might want. What the fuck is that? Well, oh, I mean, like, like ores and shit. Like you can, yeah, you can dynamite some shit down there. Are those two fish fucking each other? I think those two fish were just having interracial sex. It's twenty twenty. Interspecies, not interracial. Interspecies love making. Was a correct answer. Interspecies love making was occurring, and I witnessed it. Feel sick. Just kidding. That was. Good. And I healed. <laughs> Woo! Lima, I'm kind of, I'm kind of scared. He has legless people. LZT, how though, <laughs> and why? I, the, he's calling them guests. I don't think they're there of their own will. Do I need to call Zeke? You a cap? <laughs> you a cap? <laughs> Are you a cap? You're asking a lot cop. of questions, Kappa. <laughs> you got a lot of questions there, I'm Kappa. not a cop. I'm a kappa. Use a kappa. I can sense it. Oh fuck! I just got sucked um, the fuck down. The only thing I'm not I have a cop. In That's exactly what a cop would say. My love for donuts. That's exactly what a cop would say. My turtles. I mean, they. I mean, they can leave board. whenever they like. The door is unlocked. Oh, I mean, all right. Yeah, I accept that. But can they, they, they just, the just kind of start I just like that's, your terrifying like messages. I've been problem. watching you writing in the chat. <laughs> it's really scary. Yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm not You'd saying. Be a, such a good I mean, serial killer. <laughs> the door is unlocked. Manacles, not so much. Uh, well, I mean, you know what? Though there are those of us You're who can locks, and there are those of us who can't. Yeah, just right? out of curiosity, LZT, do mm -hmm. any of your guests have any good trades? Uh, yes. I think they all filled out the this form button. as. Yes. Voluntary test subject. So I guess they're all voluntary <laughs> test subjects. 